Hey everybody, Dorian here, and welcome back to another episode of Night in the Woods. Now, I know it's been about a week since we last played one, and I am sorry for that. Um, I spent basically all of last week hunting for a Switch before I finally got one, and then as you guys might have seen, I did some streams with Breath of the Wild and uh, Witcher 3, so. Uh, I can't remember if we already went to bed. I don't think we did. I think we were waiting. I was waiting until this started so we could go to bed. Uh, because there's probably going to be a dream se sequence, like there is in most videos, or most... The beginning of... The end of every night. God, that's what I was trying to say. Huh. <sighs> yep, and just like I expected. Suspected. Just like I suspected. <laughs> there's one right here. Oh, it wants me to move, but it's pitch black. What do you want me to do? Oh, and this bass is loud in my ears. Oh, that's very loud in my ears. Oh, I'm visible now. Yay, there's a little bit more light. Great. Am I supposed to look for the same... Is that like a war zone in the background or something? Is it possible to climb up there? No? Okay. So I just keep going straight then. All right. Yeah, okay. It looks like there's other paths, but there aren't. They're just an illusion. There, throw us off. Whew. This is a lot of running. Is this the whole dream? Is just running endlessly? Oh, no. There's a moon. Or Earth. There's something in the sky. Very bright. Is this the moon? It is a very starry sky. But I'm not moon jumping. Oh, hey! Giant spirit cat? What are you doing here? Yeah, who the fuck are you? For some reason, you're the first thing here I've thought to talk to. Okay. Alright, are you- are you God? No. Oh, are you the devil? So... Seconds ago, little creatures are coming. What? And they are asking if I am God. And I am asking what God is. And they are telling me. And I am not this God. And this God is nowhere. Well, that's where faith comes in, I guess. Little creatures are explaining faith. And mem moments ago is the beginning. And I am here then. And here now. And there is nowhere for God to be hiding. Okay, okay. So what am I doing here? Monstrous existence. No, I mean, what am I doing here? What are you? What are you? What are those giant animals? Have I been seeing ghosts? There were like bits of the world. I think I was on a train. But it was like a town. It's all, uh, I don't know, I lost it. It's kind of weird. Okay, so, uh, a great beast is walking through the sands. And they are climbing into the air. Now they are making a tear and now they are gone and now you are here a, okay a tear in what exactly with their hooves with their hooves they are making a tear little creatures are wandering through the air and they are dragging in places and echoes of lives and they are asking me about god what the fuck are you talking about dude my head actually does hurt from this. I'm going to tell you something, little creature. You are swimming further and further out to sea. And beyond are things blind and terrible. And I am showing you now. What? Why are you showing me fleas? Oh, oh god, oh god They are blind, but they are seeing you and you are coming to them After this you are not returning here. I'm climbing into the air and closing the sky What the fucker am I on? Yes, okay. I will tell you a second thing There's a hole at the center of everything and it's always growing between the stars I am seeing it, it's coming. Hold on, I'm seeing it. You're not escaping. And the universe is forgetting you. And the universe is being forgotten. And there is nothing to remember it. Not even the things beyond. 
Now there's only the hole. <sighs> okay, so does anything mean anything? This is not a question worth answering. What about my home? About my friends and family? Soon they are dying. Soon they are rotting. You are atoms, and your atoms are not caring if you are existing. Your atoms are monstrous existence. Then why am I here? God damn it, why was I chosen to see all of this in this crazy lucid dream of mine? Little creature, you are not chosen. There's no one to choose you. This is going nowhere. We are not meeting again. And the universe is forgetting you. And I am remembering you. But not because I am caring. The beginning is moments ago, but it's also moments away. There's no time to forget, but I'm going to remember before all is forgotten. Goodbye, but also hello. <laughs> okay. I don't know what that that was, but I don't like it. I'll tell you right now, I don't like that. I don't like what I was seeing. That's some blackberry lemonade. It is damn good. It is some damn good blackberry lemonade from Mod Pizza. It's actually really good. All right, let's see what we got here in this messenger, this instant messenger of mine. Oh, wow. I haven't gotten one from Angus in forever. Oh, it's just his away message still. Okay, I don't know why it alerts me that he has an away message. Hey, dude, at the old Snalkin, come to me from Boredom Supreme. Sincerely, Gregory. Morning, at the pickaxe if you're in town center today. I don't even know why I'm saying this. You're in town center every day. Anyway, see you later. And the choices continue. Which one do I pick? Which one do I hang out with? On what days do I see who? We need to go to the graveyard anyway, so I guess we'll go do that with, with uh, Bay. I kind of get you now. You're all trapped and shit. I should let you out. Are you gonna do it? Nah. Pussy. All right. All right. So per usual, we're gonna go get some pretzels, feed them to our, feed them to our rats, and then uh, we'll go to what's the place wherever Bay works, and then uh, after that. We'll go to the graveyard, dig up some graves, see if we can find something about this darned ghost that's been running around town. Causing trouble in my town. Cause I am the knight. Oh God, the volume's so loud today. The volume's so loud today. Jesus Christ. Oh shit, I gotta lower the volume. Oh my God, it's deafening. It's so, oh my God, no wonder it's all the way up. Holy shit balls, man. Holy shit balls, that's not what I wanted to edit. I wanna edit that fucking thing. Holy fucking shit, man. That was loud. Oh, that's better. Oh, it was like vibrating my ears. My precious rat babies have left their nest. No need for mama to feed them anymore. They grow up so fast. When did they leave? I don't remember them leaving. When the fuck did that happen? Last, last time I played, I had just fed them. No, I'm not ready for them to leave yet. Now I'm sad. Oh, went off to college and shit. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. That dog is such a spaz. It's so cute. And there's the rat guy up there. Oh, wait. Why am I back up here? I need to check in on them. That's what. No, they're gone. They're gone. They're gone. They're gone. Let's go talk to what's-his-face. There's still one rat left around here. Let's see if I can find a way to get up there. Eh, too much work. Let's just go find Bay. <laughs> Wherever she is. Okay, so she doesn't work at the pottery room. She works at the hardware store, I think, right?
Video output is Angus, which means Bay will work just around the bend over here, right past the Snackle Falcon. Snackle Falcon. No way. Is there anything past the Snackle Falcon? I don't think there is anything past the Snackle Falcon. There isn't anything past the Snackle Falcon. We have to keep going a little bit to the right then. I wish I could jump on these cars and ride them. Just fucking surf these cars. It'd be so cool. Does she work at Video Outpost? No. Angus works at Video Outpost. I know that much. So she must... I must have, like, bypassed her when I was up in the sky or something. It's the only thing that... Pottery Barn. No. No, she doesn't work there. Market House. Yes, the old pickaxe. The old pickaxe is where she works. What's up, Bay? How's it going? Hey, Bay. Hey. You all right? You seem down. Oh, it's nothing. You know, stuff. Don't want to talk about it? Nah. Okay. Huh. What are you up to today? Whatever you want to do. Bay. It's cool. I'm busy. And Greg and Angus have my car tonight, so I'm stuck home anyways. Oh, okay. See what up there? What they're up to, maybe? They're going somewhere or another. Was I supposed to do the graveyard, though? I'm not. Okay, so Bay obviously doesn't want to hang out today. I thought we had plans to go to the graveyard, but I guess we don't. But that's fine. I'll go say hi to best friend Greg instead. Because he's always there for me. Gregory is always there. We could stop by and say hi to Angus, but fuck Angus. Because he can't do a voice for him, so I'm just going to ignore him. Pretend he doesn't exist at all and go to my favorite one, which is Greg. Because Greg is the shit. Greg is the egg, and the egg is cool. Remember that, kids. All right. Sup, dinner. Hey, what up? How you holding up? Surviving, you know, had the weirdest dream last night. Really? I bet God. Jeez. And they were kind of an asshole. Huh. <laughs> yep, that's how my week's going. Can I offer you a complimentary slushie? To replace the idea of a caring God? I can throw in some tips. <laughs> I'm good. So it's up. Uh, you wanna hang out? Yeah, man, you throw! What the fuck is Jesus? What the fuck, Greg? What the fuck is this? That completely got me off guard. What the fuck, dude? Why do you have this in your house? This is the real thing. It's kind of our son. We brought him into this world. Oh yeah, that's the mannequin head we stole, right? The animatronic head we stole. Just Five Nights at Freddy's not taught anybody anything. Well, you helped. Kind of smells weird. Anyway, so what are you doing tonight? I don't know. We can have base car. Oh really? We should go to Donut Wolf. Oh yeah. I haven't been since I got back. I need some of those slammer cakes. They have pancakes now, too, for some reason. Oh, pancakes. Hey, Captain Donut Wolf. Take off it now. Fucking Angus is so awkward. Fine. Frank, carry out. The Donut Hell. They are such spazzes. Such spazoids. But so am I. So it works out just fine. And that's all the people I've kissed. That's two people. Kinda. One and a half. Whatever. Like you average is any better. Angus, you've been really quiet. Sorry. You okay? We're gonna get pancakes! 
Fucking Angus, dude. Hey, Angus. Angus. Hey. Gonna get them flapjacks, Angus. Paging Dr. Jackson. Dr. Flap Jackson. Please report to my belly. Okay. Yes. Pancakes. Good. Dude. Crawled up his ass. God. Damn. It. What, did we get a flat tire? I'm pulling over. No, Donut Wolf. May. I'm pulling over. We'll get there. We'll push the car. Okay, you all stay in here. Angus is the ghost killer. Because it's a flat, you don't drive on a flat. Why? Yeah, why? Fuck it, Angus. You just don't. It messes up the wheel or something. How do you know so much about cars? We can fix it. With what? We gonna get some sticks? That's silly. No, I mean, people fix tires. It's a thing people do. It's a thing people do when they have a goddamn tire. Guys, why are you being such a dick? Why am I the one that has to be the responsible one? Guys, what may? Don't yell at me. Uh, I'm gonna go wander. Fine. Fine! Okay, ugh. So someone's a little angry. Oh, God, am I watching their breakup happen? So he's crying. He's confused. He's in love. And his heart is broken. Well, that's depressing as shit. Though inevitable. Jeez, look at those woods. This is like the perfect place to dump a body. That's tough to find. Good bop and Good body dumping woods. Hard to find the body dumping woods. Could go see if there are any bodies in there. Maybe that's what I'll do while they fight in the background. Maybe not. It's not really giving me the option. Guess I'll come back here. So, what are we doing? Well, I'm trying to figure out what we're gonna do. We could call someone. Oh, do we suddenly carry phones? Because there's magically signal now in this piece of shit town. Jeez. Okay, well, fucking Angus is a dick bag. Guess I'm gonna go in the woods or something. Okay, what can fix a flat tire? Uh, sticks, rocks, leaves, wood, dirt. Maybe I can whittle a little wrench out of a log? I don't think that would work. Wonder if I could like train an owl to do owl tricks? No, focus me. Focus, let's go talk to him again. Don't have the option to. I guess we're gonna, wait, was there something in the car? Hey, dinguses! What? There's a spare tire back here. Ha ha, nice. That's one good thing. Anyone know how to like do the tire? Yeah. Can I help? Nope. Dude. Mate, you're not a bad person, but I don't trust you with any part of this process. All right, dick bag. Jeez, man. Jeez. All right, Angus, just go fix the tire or something. You, you crazy? Too bad you didn't get partially eaten by a shark. Too bad you didn't get cereal killed. Too bad you didn't start doing drugs and then died from drugs. We tried to eat a little back. Too bad you didn't OD and die from it. Okay, are you two done? Finally here. Yep. Oh uh, yeah. That wolf of donut. Ooh. Yep. And yet there's a bear serving it. What is this? Welcome to Donut Wolf, home of the Shapeshifter and Can I take your order? Cakes with special Howlin' Mad Maple Syrup. How would you like to ride the chariot today? Hello, sir. Mighty fine donuts you got there. Thank you, ma'am. We'll take half a dozen go-nuts. Dude, we should get chariot wheels. We got chariot wheels last time. I want some slammer cakes! 
Actually, we're out of slammer cakes. What the fuck? How can you be out of slammer cakes? That's like half the reason to come here. Dude, just pick something. Okay, well, we'll have a half a dozen chariot wheels. Sorry. Would you like them with eternity sauce? No. All right, all right. I'll take six doom nuts. Definitely six doom nuts. Are those new? Limited edition, ma'am. Well, they're about to be even more limited in my stomach. And no eternity sauce, please. Last time I had that, I stayed up all night digging a hole in the backyard. They found me asleep in the morning. At the bottom of a hole. Yes, ma'am. I guess, whatever. Uh, yeah, let's eat here. Fine, I'm gonna go find a seat. I have to go to the bathroom. Okay. This is fun. Kinda. Not awkward at all. What is it, May? Stop staring at yourself, May. Oh, this isn't fun. This blows. Why are things weird? Why doesn't this feel good? Everything's stupid. Depression sucks, man, especially. But your best friend's fighting with his boyfriend in front of you. I'm gonna break something. Go ahead. Break something, May. Break something hard. Oh shit. What are you what are you holding? Okay, so you're unrolling all the toilet paper? You're so fucking rebellious, May. Holy shit. Here we go. I'm gonna do this very quick. There we go. There we go, here we go. There we go. That's how you rebel. By unrolling all the toilet paper and scratching the window. Ugh! You see that? Ah, oh. I'm making a pattern with my nails. Yeah, push in that garb or flood that toilet. You fucking rebel. Angus is gonna get mad at you. What the fuck? What even happens when you do that? Can you even fit that many in there? Dad, stop! What the hell? What are you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? Destroying the bathroom. Okay, fine. That was a dumb question. Okay, why are you doing this? Do I need a reason? Yeah, I kind of think you do. Since when? What are you even doing here? Dang you. I can find my way out myself. Fine. 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 Kind of a question, but did you go before you decided to trash the bathroom? Or... God, Greg, I didn't even have to go. Okay, geez. Bye. I do now. We have a table when you're done. Leave. Okay, 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 right. Gosh. Hey, what's up, you awkward couple, you? So... Yeah, how you guys doing? Anything new other than, you know, all this stuff that's been happening? No? Oh, okay, ghosts and stuff, yeah. That's pretty new, that's some new stuff. That's some things, hey, Angus, how you like base car for tonight, yeah. She's gonna go to a party. Out of town, but I guess she lost her nerve. Oh. Greg and I were supposed to do something. This is something. No? Let's just eat. Yes, please. Let's eat. Oh, awkward as shit, man. Oh, God. God even exists. These donuts. You're not religious, right, Angus? No. Donuts ever made you think twice? No. Well, these ones do. I want this one. 
That's my donut now. So how's our son working out? He's in our living room. He sure is. Pretty great. Yeah. I guess. 30 seconds to Mars. Um. Ooh, that one looks like a Samoan. Greg, you're awful quiet. Just eating. You never had problem talking and eating at the same time. I think they broke up while I was in the bathroom. Pretty sure they broke up while I was in the bathroom. Ugh. Donut's sick already. Is anyone else saying anything? It smells. Dude. Donut wolf? The robot thing. I thought you liked it. I smell and you like me. Yeah, to both of those things. Greg spent a lot of time and effort on that robot because he thought you'd love it. No, he did it because it was fun. No matter what could happen. Jeez. Awkward as shit. No, I want the one you took. Ugh, feeling woozy. Ate so many donuts. Angus, you're being rude. I'm being rude? We're trying to get out of here, both working our asses off, and you come waltzing back into town, and suddenly Greg is breaking into grocery stores? Abandon ones! And like stealing car batteries? Abandon ones! And messing up our already crappy apartment? Hey, dude, come on. Wait, how is this my fault? Whatever, I'm eating. No, you took the black and white one. I wanted the black and white one, you bitch. Ah, oh, cripes. Oh, sweet cripes. <laughs> Fall into the sky. Too many donuts, dude. Way too many donuts. Shit, dude. Shit, dude. Guess we'll sit here and hash this out, I guess. It was all weird colored. Puke usually, puke usually ends in that color. It was like multiple colors. You okay, man? I have a really weak stomach. Yeah, you puke a lot. I get pukey all like baby food, the inside of pumpkins, any beer, too much donuts. I'd never puke. My mouth tastes like broken dreams. Whatever that tastes like. I'm really mad at you two. Why? I hate awkward silences and I'm ruining your lives or something. Just tell me if I am instead of whatever this is. Do you not like me anymore, Angus? What? No, May, I like you fine. Why are you being weird then? Uh, so, Angus, I'll take this. Thanks, hon. I guess they didn't break up. May, remember my uncle? Sheep farm, I passed bridal. Out by the interstate. Yeah, kinda. When I was like eight, my parents got sick of me and made me spend the month there in the summer. And I spent the whole time following him around. Sheeps are nice. Got to pet one once. Sheeps are really dumb is what they are. Right afternoon before my uncle left me by the pen, and for some reason I opened the gate. Why? I have no idea. Kids are like sheep. Really dumb. So a bunch of the sheep basically immediately bolted, and I chased after being all, You dumbass sheep! He tried, Bug. They ran across the field and into the woods. And there was this really steep hill that went down to the interstate. Oh god, oh no, what happened? Four got spattered by a semi-truck. Shot ran right back up the hill. But three, three made it over to the median. And across to the other side. And they just stopped. And I got to the bottom of the hill by the road. Which is like covered in sheep guts and parts. And just when we looked at each other across the interstate. Me waving my hands. She ran back. Got hit by another truck. God. But the other one. He ran down the hill on the other side. Into the woods. And no one ever saw him again. Jeez, dude. What happened after that? I mean, I ran back to the farm crying. My uncle hit me a bunch. No. Yeah. There was some legal stuff. And they moved away not long after. That's awful for you. Poor sheep. But if I was in their position, I'd have run too. And I want to be the one that got away. And I want Angus to come with me. I like failed those sheep. Just like you know, everything has failed us. 
It's a bit depressing. You no know, one even denies it. No one tries to talk you out of leaving here. And yeah, being the only queer people in the town sucks. I'm here. You already left once. But I mean, I'm back. I can't stay. We can't stay. Yes. I love Angus. I love both of you. Obviously in different ways. Thanks for clarifying. We have a plan. We're working our asses off to make it happen. Do you guys full time minimum wage? I have to grow up a bit. I did grow up a bit. Mate, you have to let me change. Fuck, dude. That's some heavy shit to drop on me. Sorry I was rude earlier. It's okay. Some heavy shit, man. Some heavy, heavy shit. Remember the time we almost burned down the school? <laughs> yeah. Fireworks, student council poster, just whoosh. God, that was a good night. Slug from the sprinklers, running through the parking lot, laughing our asses off. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. That was maybe the best night of my entire life. It's one of the all time greats. Kids still talk about it. That night lives on, man. Well, we can at least be legends forever. It's sad. Well, tonight was a complete bust. I'm sorry. <laughs> Stop apologizing, Angus. I'm sorry too. It's cool. And I have an idea. Uh, yeah? Yeah, for one more big crime? You can come this time, Angus. Do a crime with us. Uh, I... Okay. Ta Captain, Captain Criminal! Let's go! You guys gonna light it on fire? Oof! This thing is gonna be really freak some kids out. Yeah, dude. They're gonna yell, tell stories about this thing. They'll never know what it is or how it got here. You yeah, sure you're okay with it? Yeah, this is a good home for it. Leave it for the kids. Let it be a legend. Hmm, yeah. Too bad it didn't fall on you. Too bad you didn't get your arm caught in the gears. Too bad both of you didn't get trapped in the car after a wreck and explode all over the road. And have to be scraped up with a snow shovel. Nice. Decent, Captain. <laughs> that was cute. That was a cute moment. Alright, well, moving on. Yep. Everyone's moving on. Everyone's moving on. Goodbye. That's sad. It's a sad coming of age story where you lose your friends and. People go their separate ways and and animatronics come to life in the dead of night, like it's fucking Five Nights at Freddy's. Rather not deal with that. Not tonight, Dad. Not tonight. Not tonight. I'm going to bed and I'm not dealing with that goddamn thing. Holy shit! Do we even have any messages? All right, let's see what we got here. Hey, bae, you up? Yes, ma'am, what's up? Nothing. A little sick from Donut Wolf. Yeah, that's why I don't go there. It's so good. How can it be so good and like so mean to you? It's a wild world, May. Anyway, I puked up and then we were up, uh, dropped the robot off the woods. Okay, I'm going to sleep to just try to decipher that. Go to sleep. I'm going to sleep. Hey, man. Hey, man. Sorry about everything. Are we still apologizing? Can we be past that part? <laughs> Sorry. I mean, you know. <laughs> Night, dude. Night. Hey, circle. All right. All right. Well, that's where we're going to leave it off for this episode. Um, didn't end up going to the graveyard like we thought, but we got a little more in depth into uh, the dynamic between May and Angus, as well as Angus and Greg. Um, and that they are definitely leaving. And at some point in this game, we're going to have to say goodbye to them. It's going to be sad. And things are slowly starting to pick up. You're starting to see some things happen. Uh, some supernatural things like her dreams and that ghost. And then the animatronic in the woods and whatever that, that was. Um, so I'm really excited to see what's going to be going on further in this game. Other than that, um, thank you guys all for watching. Um, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Other than that, I hope you all have a wonderful day. And I'll catch you all in my next video. Later.